What up, y'all? It's the one and only Lowell Bellinger. Here to quickly talk about how climate change has impacted the most vulnerable and impoverished communities. So as you guys know, Western countries and Western societies, they have a lot more resources and shields in order to protect themselves from the effects of climate change. In developing countries, what you have to understand is that a lot of the people's livelihoods are tied to the land and water. So let me just come to you guys a few quick examples of how climate change has impacted the most vulnerable communities. So first, you have severe drought. And when you have drought, it causes disruptions in the food supply chain. You also have withered crop, crops and animal starvation. Most importantly, you have floods, hurricanes, and tornadoes that completely wipe out the infrastructure and homes of these vulnerable peoples. You also have to understand is that the main source of conflict in third world countries is due to climate change. And climate change causes scarcity in land and water. So you have all these people fighting over resources. And this can lead to all types of conflicts, wars, and genocides. You also have to understand what recently happened in America. You know, tornadoes completely wipe out the infrastructure and homes of these vulnerable people. And a lot of these people don't have the resources or money in order to update their homes and infrastructure in order to make them more climate resilient. So what we need is a lot more climate mitigation projects in order to protect vulnerable people, not only in America, but throughout the globe. Thank you for watching. Lowell Bellinger.